Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to get the Legacy Windows Photos app back for Windows 11. Uh, so you might have noticed that there's a new Windows Photos app out in Windows 11. And if you like to use the video editor and not ClipChamp, which is what uh, Microsoft's trying to get you to use now, you could install the Legacy Photo app. So if you go to the Microsoft Store and you look for Microsoft Photos Legacy and you do a search for it, it'll show you the, the current one. And, you know, you got to browse around here and not sure how easy it is to find. So what I like to do is click on search, look, for, do a search for video editor. Let's type it in here. See, it tries to get you to use ClipChamp. And it says get ClipChamp, so if you don't have it. And then you could also click on get photos legacy. This is So this is a quick way to get you to the Microsoft Store, right to the uh, app itself. So here's the old one here. So we'll click on get. Get rid of this. All right, so now we can click on open. Telling you that welcome to Photos Legacy. Okay, so obviously it looks similar to the new one, but now we have the video editor here. And it still wants you to open ClipChamp. So here's the uh, old video editor. I'm still obviously trying to get you to use ClipChamp. So you can start this uh, video editor just like you could before. So, and then you can toggle back and forth between your photos and the video editor just like you could with the uh, original Photos app. All right, so once again, just do a search for Video editor. Let me close this out here. Okay, well now it finds it since I have it installed, but if you didn't have it installed, it would bring you up the option in the old photo editor, or the rich, the new photo editor, and then you could uh, go right to the Microsoft Photos Legacy page and then download the original photo app, and then you'll have your original video editor if you don't want to use ClipChamp. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. Thank <laughs> you.